It's post time for tonight's fifth race. Open pace for mares, a field of nine, all lined up in behind the gate, heading toward the start. And they're off, and artistic vision is blasting out from the outside as usual. Now Luke takes a hold of her as time frame in, heads out quickly from mid-pack for the lead. Armbro View has gotten away well. Giggles the Clown is right there on the inside fourth as artistic vision is parked to her outside. Molly can do it, gets an early tap with the whip. She's come out racing in fifth as they head toward the opening quarter. Moe Motion ends sixth on the inside. Then it's a break of two to Armbro Wallflower. Nuclear Finale has come out eighth, and see you Hanover the trailer opening quarter up in 27 seconds flat and artistic vision ranging up on the outside now takes the lead and time frame in will yield for the pocket spot in second armbro view is tracking the top pair third and here comes miller making his move with molly can do it on the outside moe motion in jumps out quickly to grab that cover and giggles the clown is shuffled back locked in on the inside armbro wallflower third over for campbell and molly can do it with a strong backside brush has taken command as they hit the half and 55 and 4. Artistic Vision now back in the pocket in second. That leaves Moe Motion and uncovered first up on the outside. Further back in the field, Nuclear Finale trying to catch the cover flow from third over. And CU Hanover feeling the pinch is dropped out last, trailing the field as they head to three quarters. And Molly Can Do It is on the lead. Artistic Vision is right on her helmet there in second. Tough grind for Moe Motion and first up. Time frame and needs some racing room. Armbro Wallflower takes a look three wide. Three Three quarters and 123 and two, and it's Molly can do it. Artistic Vision pops out of the pocket. Armbro Wallflower hitting her best stride on the outside. Molly can do it, digging in. Artistic Vision drifting a bit, trying to rally to her in second. Then it's time frame in, and Armbro Wallflower, Molly can do it, is almost there. And at the line, it's Molly can do it to win from Artistic Vision and time frame in in 151 and two. Returning to the winner's circle, number five, Molly Can Do It. A Camlux six-year-old mare out of Reveille Kathleen by Abercrombie, owned by the Enviro Stables Limited, Langfelder, A&I Stables, and Three Brothers Stables of New York and Georgia. Linda Toscano, the trainer, and Dave Miller is in the sulky. Molly Can Do It has won three of her last four at the Big M. She's the defending Breeders' Crown champion, and she scores tonight in 151 and two-fifths. Results posted official. Fifth race is Roseanne's 65th ravioli run. We welcome Roseanne Lesko to her night at the races here at the Big M. She's joined in the winner's circle by Charles and Douglas Lesko and Catherine Bartolotto. So Roseanne celebrating her 65th, making the trophy presentation for the fifth race. Number five, Molly Can Do It, pays 540, 320, 260. Finishing second, number nine, Artistic Vision, four dollars three sixty, and third, number six, Time Frame in four eighty to show. Exact accommodation five and nine twenty seven twenty. The five nine six try one sixty seven eighty. Pick three of four nine five three thirty four even. Sick. No changes in the eighth or ninth races. Post time for the sixth and fourth.